Yo, what the fuck? Oh my god, bro. Just stuck in hella fucking mud, yo. What the fuck? Forgive me, y'all. Forgive me. Forgive me. You know I don't do no editing, man. We ain't stopping the video. Fuck it. It's always beans and rice with me. Fuck it is, man. It's Pill Bellamy in this bitch. You heard me. You mad or not? Real quick, bro. Real quick. I want to get niggas my consensus. Right? On this JC versus Sharon battle. It's my second watch. You hear me? Shit just dropped on the app. I watched it again. It's the second time I've seen it. Only seen it once, like when it shit at live. So that's really break it down. You hear me? Let's really break it down. First round. First round. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it a being the first round close. You hear me? Like, anybody that's saying like Sharon got the first round clearly is geeking. Just like anybody that's saying JC got the first round is geeking. Like, it's a close round. Like, when I first watched, I edged to Sharon. You hear me? Like, when I watched it on Caffeine, I gave it to Sharon, but on the playback, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wanna give it to JC. And I ain't being biased, I just feel like I don't want to say it was a lot of gas in the building for Sharon first round. I mean, niggas ain't see Sharon in a minute, so it's, it's some shock value there. Any white boy, you hear me? Like, a cheesy white boy. Like, I, I hate to mention that, but I got to keep it a bit. That definitely plays a part, but I, I, I kind of feel like JC was saying more. Now, Sharon round was longer, but I just feel like JC, like, might have had, like, like he might have had better substance. You feel me? Like, his schemes, his punches, his metaphors, like, but I like what Sharon do. He's straight to the point. You feel me? He's straight to the point. But JC shit was a little bit more complex. So it, it, uh, it's debatable. It, it's a debatable round, man. It, it, it can go either way. That's how I got to call it. It can go either way. Second round. The second round, JC fucked Sharon up. You feel me? And I felt like the, like the second round changed... It, like it changed the entire tempo of the battle, bro. Like, cause, like, cause if if think about it, like when Sharon like first started rap, like like the first like minute and a half of his of his second round, like niggas like wasn't cheering. Like it kind of felt like JC turned the crowd against him, like turned the building against him, cause he he like he he introduced he introduced his third round angle. You feel me? Like he didn't really expound on it, but it was points of the second round where. He indulged a little bit, so it it, it kind of like, it, like it it, it kind of uh, uh, took the, the the momentum away from Sharon. But JC was saying some shit. Like JC had some shit in his second round. You hear me? Sharon, Sharon, I like Sharon's second round was cool. It was a little, it was a little dry. You feel me? But I'm definitely giving the second round to JC. Like like no debate. You feel me? That like that that round goes to him clip. Third round, now. I'm going to keep it a bean. I'm going to have to get a little bias. You feel me? I'm going to have to get a little bias. And, and I, I've been hearing the speculation, like, you know what I mean? Like, a lot of, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, uh, it's a significant amount of people who gave, like, the battle of Sharon. They feel like, yeah, uh, JC had the little race angle in the third, but Sharon was, like, really rapping. Like, he had some shit. Like, he was, just, like, you, you know, like, niggas like to take points away from you. When you use an angle, it's like, you know how, like, with Pokemon cards, like, like a fire type can't do nothing against a water type. Like, it's, like, it's useless. It's, like, they act like people who angle, like, they act like people who angle don't stand a chance against a nigga that's punching. It, like, they act like, 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 angles is, is not effective against a nigga that's punching your lights out. But that's not true, bro, because, like, angles have a huge impact, bro. Like, angles can destroy your career. Angles can make everybody look at you different. You feel me? So, let me just get to the point. I don't give a fuck what Sharon said in this third round. I'm going to keep it. I don't give a fuck what he said. It's, bro, I'm giving the third round to JC. Like, his shit was, like, that prolific to me, bro. He broke that shit down. Like, and when I watched it the first time, I thought he was really, like, I thought he genuinely was going to actually, like, figure out a way to talk about him getting slapped. He did. I mean, he did play on it a little bit. He didn't talk about it, but it was it was more to it. It was, it was definitely more to it. 
Bro, JC third round was so real, bro. Like, it's only going to resonate with the real. You know, the real recognize the real. It's only going to resonate with the real. If you just a nigga, if you just a, I ain't going to say goofy ass nigga. We're not, not going to do that. I'm not going to say goofy ass nigga. But if you just a nigga, just a battle rap nigga who want to hear bars and shit and you ain't like into the real life shit and, and like and like the gossip and shit or the angle shit, like, you're not going to like it. You're going to be like, JC wasn't saying much. I'm tired of race angles, bit, bit, bop. Feel me? But if you real, bro, if you real, that shit resonated with you bro and that shit resonated with me you hear me like i like for real like it's yo oh my god bro that shit be weird because it's like shit be getting like cringy like i ain't talking about jc i'm just saying like you can like i'm big on energy so like it, it might sound crazy to y'all but i can feel energy through the phone just watching something and like i'm sorry i can feel energy through the phone it's like shit got a little cringy like nigga like bro was walking on eggshells when he started talking about race and white people and exposing them, it was like, I mean, people would cheer when he had like something that, that sound remotely close to a punchline.